So a lot of us all are familiar with the story of a young farm man, Luke Skywalker, who was thrust into adventure and tasked with saving the galaxy from the evil Darth Vader and Emperor Palpatine. These are space warriors and warlocks battling for the fate of their galaxy. But what if I told you that there was more to this? I know, I know, but just bear with me, I think you'll come around to my way of thinking. After noticing a father-son theme in the new Star Wars film, The Force Awakens, I started to think maybe it was in the other films too. And after rewatching the original trilogy, I'm convinced of some heavy father-son themes. But there's something else about The Force Awakens that I noticed, and eagle-eyed viewers may have too, though I haven't seen anything on the blogs or anything. But watch it again, and in the background of one of the scenes, there's a clue hinting that Rey might not know who her parents are, and her parentage might even be important. Now, this got me thinking. Luke didn't know his parents, so maybe there's something there. And after rewatching the original trilogy again, I'm convinced that there's something there. Luke is parentless all the time, and even asks about his dad once. How did my father die? Here's Luke without a dad. Here he is again with no dad to speak of. We're constantly being shown that he is dadless. Or is he? Let's look at the very first time we ever see Darth Vader. He blasts through a door and walks down a hallway through a cloud of smoke. Now, what I think this scene represents is a father, Darth Vader, walking in on a daughter, the Leia character, when she's been smoking. He scolds her, she pouts. It's a highly clever and symbolic scene that links Leia and Vader. And if you've seen my other recent video, Leia and Luke are at least siblings, which I've linked in the comments, then you know where I'm going with this. If we accept that the Star Wars character, Princess Leia, is the daughter of the Darth Vader character in Star Wars, then that's right, Luke, being at least Leia's brother, would be the son. And here he is watching a bunch of smoke, which I think links him even more with the scene. Like, he's the straight-edge child watching from afar as his sister gets reamed out for doing pot. So I think I've already proven that Luke at least represents being the son of Darth Vader, who I think, if you think about it, represents being a dad kind of character. Like, in this pivotal scene, we hear him say, when first I was a learner, now I am the master. So he's saying, now he's a master. Master being a word meaning a male head of household, and most of those are dads. He's saying, I'm the master, I'm taking over the house. See, he's the dad now. I mean, take the very name, Darth Vader. Darth, what is that if the letters were corresponding numbers? Well, D is four, A is one, then R is 18, T is 20, and H is 8. A trilogy is 3, so let's take the last 3. 20 minus 18 is 2. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 4's corresponding letter is D, so now we have D-A-D, -D, which is a way to spell dad. Also, just in general, Darth is kind of like dad, sound-wise. And Vader sounds like the Vader part of Invader, as in he invaded Luke's mother's womb with his spermatozoa and impregnated her. Also, Vader basically sounds like a guy who has a really deep voice, which I think a lot of dads probably do. I don't know, my dad's voice is pretty low, not like Vader low, but pretty low. Also, at one point, he says this. I am your father. So here we have the word father, which is American English and English for the Dutch Vader which is the character's name. So why would he say his name? I am Vader. Not a very interesting line two thirds of the way through the trilogy, but he says I here, not me. I, as in the Roman numeral I, as in the number one, as in number one dad. What he's saying here is number one dad is Vader. And if you watch the films, you'll notice Vader does all kinds of dad stuff, all kinds of times. Here he is waving at his son's friend, like a dad would do. Here he is protecting his daughter from bad boys, like a dad does. And let's go back to that one of him waving at the friend character. Waving with those black gloves? Hmm, where have I seen gloves before? That's right, on Luke, the only other character to wear gloves. And if you know anything about the extended universe, you'll know why that's important. George Lucas was clearly trying to tell us something. 
But what? Well, I think he's trying to tell us that Darth Vader from Star Wars is Luke Skywalker from Star Wars' dad. But is he? Well, you'll have to watch part two to find out. Uh, thanks for watching this one, though. Be sure to subscribe to know when part two comes out. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, like the video if you've ever seen Star Wars and share it if you clicked like. Uh, thanks, guys. Bye.